morning everyone happy saturday i'm just finishing up today's main channel video which is my favorite thing to do on a saturday morning i'm always up bright and early on a saturday specifically for this reason even if it's like up and ready to go i like to make sure that you know just like i've checked the description box i've checked this i've checked that that it's perfect i know some people are gonna think that's so silly but i'm so specific this morning we are going for breakfast at a place called Briarfields. don't actually know where it is maybe it's in titchwell i'll ask we're going there anyway i've got this gorgeous zara dress on which i actually haven't taken the label off yet it was in my last zara haul what do you think i love it i know some people are going to think it's so granny-ish and like in my 20s i shouldn't be wearing flowy dresses like this but i actually think it's really cute and i just think for like a nice easy weekend where i'm not trying to impress anyone but i still want to feel really good this is like the perfect dress i'm just going to shove my birkenstocks on with it grab my little louis and we're ready to go you can kind of see the outfit of the day better here please ignore the hair i just shoved it up and it did look cute because it was higher and now it's fallen down can you see so yeah the dress is zara i really think it's gorgeous i showed lucy and she hates it sorry if you can hear the vacuum that's mum i've got my little mini speedy no nano speedy and then just my burks and it's just super comfy cozy i need to find some more like elegant sandals that are actually comfy because Birkenstocks are so comfy I'm like why would I ever wear anything else but they're quite chunky so I need to figure that out so this is my breakfast I got poached egg and avocado on toast with some rocket and this is mine so if you had a croissant with and then the best jam in the world and then dad got English breakfast with a side of avocado so he basically got the same as us but with sausages and everything as well I've got the same as me. So this is Bridewell's. What village are we in? Thornham. Thornham. It's on the edge of Thornham. And oh, oh no, we're not Titchwell. 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 Oh, on the, I was going to say we're on the edge of Titchwell. It's like right on the edge of the village, isn't it? Um, yeah, it's really nice. This is what the entrance looks like. We just had the loveliest breakfast. It was, it was like brunch. Oh my gosh, it's so windy. Look at my hair. I'm trying to walk Cody at the same time, but it yeah, has the most incredible view. You can see the sea. I'll show you in a second. But yeah, I would give the breakfast. 7 out of 10. That's the view. I'm not too sure if you can see the sea, but I can see the sea in real life. It's just down there. They've got like a play area and everything. A lot of outdoor space. It's really lovely. This is my first time here. We've just got to the car park in Thorn and we're going to go for a walk along the coastal path. And Cody, are you ready? Are you going to get your paws muddy? He's like, Yay! he's like, no. No, mud, ew. So everyone seems to be going over there. We're going over yes. that way. Yeah. And well, that's, that's been the, coast, down the coastal path. We normally go to like Brancaster. I I, I can't remember ever coming here. You did. A long, long time ago in a land far away. We've just got off the beach. We went to, I keep forgetting where we are. It's terrible, isn't it? Were we in Thornham? Yes. Yeah, we went to, wow, the beach in Thornham. It's quite a walk, but it was really, really lovely. So many sand dunes, it was beautiful. I mean, I'll sh I showed you, obviously. And Dad took some of the most awesome pictures of me, which is really cool. Dad's like my favorite, sorry, mum, my <laughs> favorite photographer. <laughs> Whenever we go on holiday to like Disney or Orlando or whatever, <laughs> Dad always gets a, your you're great too. You're the perfect height. Dad always gets up early with me and like, honestly, I dragged him into the park at Disneyland Paris at literally 7 a.m. to go and take pictures of me. And he did it so well and he's so on it. It's just, honestly, he gets the angles so right. I, I said to him, I was like, we share a vision. We're going to Drove, Drove Orchard. So we're going to Drove Orchard because I need a, a coconut, which sounds really random. But like I said yeah, in yesterday's vlog, why I bought that bikini from Jack Wills, I've got a campaign to shoot. Boys car. I've got a campaign to shoot and I need to be holding a coconut in it. That's what they like. It's not It's not for my content, it's for a brand. I'm shooting it like for their stuff. A brand that I work with a lot actually. And I want to shoot it outside and do like an outdoor shower kind of vibe and they wanted me to be holding a coconut. So yeah. So we're at Drove Orchard and I am on the hunt for a coconut. Now do we think I'm going to be in luck? I'm not sure. I bet they'll have everything but. It's like a tropical fruit, isn't it? And all these are local. That's the problem. 
lemons. I love a good lemon. These look like veggies. Oh my gosh, they've absolutely got everything but, haven't they? Oh, pears, they look nice. So there was no coconuts. It was all local fruit. And they grow most of it here. A lot Which of makes sense. fruits as well here. Yeah, uh, so what we did get was some apricots, some pears, I don't know what else, I'll show you when we're home. And also, some takeout coffees. So we got a hot chocolate, two cappuccinos, and a soy latte, I'm very, look at her. Is she doing this in the background of every shot? Yeah. She probably is. She usually does. It's so funny. We've got some very tired dogs. Yeah, Cody's asleep on the floor. Max is down there. They do have their seat belts attached, by the way. They are safe. Pardon? my hot That one's yours. Thank you. Do you want me to pass it to you? It might be hot. Yeah, it is hot. Do you want me to keep it till it's cool? Or? Yes, okay. I don't know why you're laughing. <laughs> you're on. He's just been ragging the car round the bends, right? Look at my dress. No, you were going so fast. I'll give you one job, hold the coffee, and then you spin it. I hope there's some left in it. Dad, stop <laughs> He's trying not to laugh, he thinks it's funny. I just don't think this is funny. I'm not laughing either, it's not funny. Also guys, I just watched that last clip back, and when I said something to Dad, I can't even remember what I said the first night, it sounded so much like Anastasia Kings North. We actually really live close together, which makes sense why I sound like her, but random. We're having dog training session, aren't Can I we? Show them? Mm, please okay, go for let it. Me, let me reset the jump. I knocked it with my leg. Wait, Cody. Because you're all just so desperate to see the dog show. Yeah. They spend hours doing it. He's refused to do it, Mum. Mummy's refused to do it. Okay. Right, guys, I'm going to hide. I think I have a problem. Yeah, you do. Okay, Good afternoon. What time is it? Five o'clock. Twenty to five. We <laughs> she's being annoying. So we're gonna go and get some dinner, aren't we? An early dinner. We had brunch and dinner today because we just thought we wanted to kind of miss the crowds. It's quite busy around here at the moment, isn't it? So we're gonna head to basically the place where we went grocery shopping earlier, and they have like a pizza place and a fish and chips place, and we're just gonna go and assess the situation. So we fancy. Sophie looks really cute. She's got her new Jack Wheels hoodie on, which she treated and herself to Jack yesterday. Top. And her top, she looks very grown up. But you little man, come on. You need to come in, come to your bed. Come on. Come on. He's like, where are we going then? We have to go inside. Come on. Come on, Hello. Come on, Dad. As you can tell, he's very obedient. In. In. He is actually a really good boy. Come on, Cody, get in your bed. We're in a yurt about to eat pizza. It's called Eric's Pizza. I'm getting Marguerite's pizza and some veggies. And then I think we're getting a selection of antipasties to start. I'm getting macaroni. Oh, really? Yeah. It's a pizza restaurant. Yeah. I'm sure it would be nice, actually. Sophie loves pasta. Anything pasta. I'm addicted. Mum, tell you the word addicted to everything I say. Okay, so, uh, to macaroni and cheese, Sophie is addicted. Your favourite word is addicted. You pronounce it addicted. What hit you in the face? <laughs> uh, I'll explain to you when we get home. This is our dinner. How good does this look? A burrata, pizzas, antipasti. Sophie got mac and cheese, garlic bread. Oh my gosh, this looks incredible. Right, are you too tired now? <laughs> We're just cooking some bacon because we're going out on the boat tomorrow morning. So we're making bacon sandwiches to eat on the boat, aren't we? Yeah. That's my job. I should probably find. Oh, I see the bread. Are we doing the, the um, rolls and the seeded bread, or? Uh, we're doing a couple of rolls, usually, and then we've got some seeded bread. As well. Cool. We bought some bacon from the uh, farm shop earlier from the butcher, and 
very excited to eat these in the morning. These are the things that you make and then you're excited about, like, all night. So you guys, me and my particularly messy hair, wow, it's so naughty, are about to head off to bed. I've had the best day. It's been a long day, but a really, really fun one. I really hope you've enjoyed joining along. I am up bright and early in the morning because we're going to launch the boat and tide times are very early tomorrow. So we're literally leaving the house at like seven. So yeah, I hope you're excited to see that. If you are, please give this a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe and I'll see you bright and early in the morning.